Hi there and welcome back. Now in this part of the tutorial we're going to look at editing and adding our own content. Now just to quickly recap, you're hosting your website on a platform called WordPress which quite simply is a content management system but you have to remember that it was originally developed as a blogging platform so you will see on the front page that there are blog entries and static pages are in the menu bar on the right hand side. Now if you want to run a blog then this is the basic setup, this is all you need. What I'm going to do for the purpose of this tutorial is I'm going to change the front page so it displays the about page as like a, it's a welcome page for example and move the blog entries to a separate page called blog. So I'm going to log into my WordPress control panel by just under meta clicking login providing my login details, login again. For now ignore everything else that you see here in the sidebar I'm going to click on pages and you'll see here I've only got one page at the moment a sub menu has opened up which I can open manually by clicking this arrow here up and down I'm going to click add new page I'm going to put blog as the title you don't need to put any content WordPress will do that for you I'm going to click publish we go back to the main website you'll see now there's a new page called blog I still need to set the about page as the welcome page and move the blog entries to the blog page so let's go back to site admin and if we come down to the settings menu expand that by clicking the down arrow click on reading and just up here it says front page displays I want to set that a, as a static page front page about me post pages blog save changes go back to my website and you'll see now the welcome page is the about me page and the blog entries are now actually on the blog page itself because I'm logged in as the administrator there's a link under each post and each page that for editing that content so if I want to edit the about page I can just click edit this entry and I can start editing content just the same way I would an email and when I'm done doing my changes click update page go back to my website and you see that's changed now. Now I'm going to add a blog entry and I should probably mention that you don't need to run a blog on your website. Most people use the blog feature of WordPress to announce product news or website news or company news. So if you're running a company website you could use your blog page as a, a news page. So what we're going to do is we're going to add a new blog entry. We're going to click Site Admin. And I'm going to click New Post up here. I could come down to the Post menu and click Add New there as well, but it's quicker just to click Add New Post here. I'm going to write my post. Okay, once I'm done, you can ignore everything else for now. This is just demonstrating how to add a new post. Click Publish. Or I can save it as a draft if you're in the middle of doing something and you have to pop off. Save it as a draft and you can come back later and continue. Click Publish. Go back to the main website. Click on Blog. And there's my new post. So that's how you add, edit and delete content within WordPress. In the next tutorial I'm going to go over the control panel a little bit more with you and explain a lot more about the menu system and the dashboard and until then thank you for watching